Hello guys, welcome to Tutorials Point. Uh, we are in the middle of video lecture where we are studying about Android application development. Till now we have seen uh, the parts of Android like what is Android, what, are, what is Android Studio. In the last lecture we covered about the components of Android. This lecture is focused on the very important file or the starting block of Android. We call it the Android Manifest file. Android Manifest file is a explicit name. We have to mention it the similar way every time when we are making this file. And this file is already added into our application. It should be present in the SRC, in the main, in here. This file is the Android Manifest.xml file. This file would be having all the components as I already told you that, you know, like your activity, your resources, everything is there that, that is there in the application is the so this is a typical file if you would have seen your own application the hello world application that you have made this file would be having such a architecture such a structure now what are all these things let's go into them one by one and see what are all these things so the android manifest.xml is having an xml tag which is the starting point of the application and tells a version of xml that is that it's using then it's having under the manifest file, it is defining the XML name schema of Android as this. Then is the package. Just for information, package is a very important part of an Android application. If you have ever been into your uh, application manager and then you would have seen that the package defines or identifies your application. Your application can have only one package. Which if, by this I mean that say if I'm having three applications then they need to have different packages because in Android package is the unique identifier of the application. No two applications can have the same package. Then is the application. Application means it's a starting tag of an application. By, by this I mean that the application is starting from here and from here I would be having all the information for the application in this part. So let's see what all the application tag has. Application tag is having an icon. Icon is something in the MIP map as IC launcher. This means that under the MIP map folder, I think you can recall where was MIP map folder. MIP map folder was in SRC main RES folder. The MIP map is a resource and it's in the RES or the resource folder. So this is the icon and this icon looks something like this. You can call it as the preview of the icon. So whenever you are uh, running your application from the application drawer, this would be shown to you. Then the label. By label, I mean, what is the application all about? Or what's, uh, how do I, what is the label on the top of the application? How do I identify the application? These all things are defined by the label. Then I'm having the theme of the application. And after this, I'm having the activity. Now, if you remember what was activity, activity was that UI component of the application that you are seeing, right? Now, whenever I'm